Hey everyone, Shannon Shea here. Welcome to the Geeky In Report. And today we're just going to do something fun and casual. What we're going to do is we're going to do a review of Hokkaido Red Bean Kit Kat. Now, the story behind this Kit Kat is I had a friend who got to go to Osaka recently. Tell us much. And he brought me back red bean paste Kit Kat. He knows I love red bean paste. In fact, I love red bean paste so much, I've often said if I could have red bean paste every day, I wouldn't eat chocolate anymore. I love it so much. In Japan, Kit Kat is like a cultural phenomenon unto itself. It's not like here where Kit Kat comes in chocolate and occasionally in white chocolate. Kit Kat is epic. They have their own flagship store for Kit Kat. And this is upside down. In Japan, when you say good luck to someone, you say kitsugatsu, and means good luck. And this is often said to people going to take a test, especially in school, the school children. And what better way to then give them a little motivation than to give them a Kit Kat? Yes, Kit Kat made notice of this too. So back to this red bean paste Kit Kat. This was a box of 10 that he got me. Oh, spoiled. In it, it comes with these little boxes. And in each of these little boxes, and I already opened, opened one off, because I don't need to open more than one, but let's let give you a real quick view of that Kit Kat. And on the back, it's got a little place to write a message to somebody if you want to write a message to them. Obviously, you'll probably write Kitsukatsu there. Inside each of these, you will find three of these little packets. And... They also have a little place to write a message, just in case you want to give this as an individual little piece to someone. And while we get four pieces of Kit Kat per um, package of Kit Kat here in America, they get these little tiny pieces like this. And if you break that in half and stack them, that's about one of our Kit Kats. So even though they get this cool packaging and they get a box and everything, they are only getting three pieces instead of four pieces of Kit Kat. But then it's red bean paste, so who cares? As you probably have already suspected, I've already eaten some of the red bean paste. And my review of it is that it doesn't really taste like red bean paste to me. And I've consumed enough to really know. <laughs> so, yeah, so like I said, it is good. It has a little Kit Kat logo. I don't know if you can see it on it. It, to me, it doesn't taste like red bean paste, so that's it. Red bean paste doesn't really taste like red bean paste, but it is good enough to want to eat the whole box. So I will proceed to now go and do that. Not the whole box, not all, not all 10 packages, not right now. 